I, I told you guys if I were to, you know, buy Shiba or Doge, like I would, I would definitely be going with Doge at this point uh, over over Shiba, and this would, you know, seem to, to seem like that. I saw Martin guy telling people if they've never bought any crypto at all before and they didn't want to buy Bitcoin, to buy Dogecoin. Bitboy Crypto talking about Dogecoin. Why? Because the Twitter deal with Elon Musk may go through and that's pretty exciting because elon musk he loves he loves he loves himself some doge he loves the crypto world he may make advertisers pay in dogecoin but then again he didn't mention how about no advertising take twitter private make users pay a fee just to have a stupid blue check mark because they're all about the blue check marks right i don't use twitter it's vile it's a den of vipers it's a venom. It's it's a war zone. You enter that war zone. He buys it, cleans house, and he adopts Dogecoin as the Twitter standard. And if you pay a couple bucks a month to get your blue check, that'd be awesome. Uh, let's go into one more article on Doge here and Musk. Uh, Dogecoin jumps nearly 14% of reports that self-proclaimed Doge father Elon Musk made by Twitter. Awesome. And in a sea of red today being, I don't know, what, what is today? 25 April, uh, we have green and Doge, and Bitcoin is green. This is, these are mixed equities and mixed equities and crypto. And uh, yeah, Doge is tickered up a little bit, not much. And now, now over here, they're saying how Dogecoin could one day be the future of currency. Robinhood CEO, I don't trust Robinhood. Look at what they did to the uh, shareholders when Wall Street Bets was going, you know, buying AMC. They uh, screwed over a lot of investors and showed you who actually runs the money. So as George Carlin says, it's a big club, guys. You ain't in it. You're not controlling the money and they control you. So you may try to control the markets through like uh, Reddit, the Wall Street, but the big players will shut you down because they don't want the game exposed, but it's exposed. All right. There was an article here too. Dogecoin fans have lots to say about Musk owning Twitter. I'll tell you what I'm leading up to here. Dogecoin fans have lots to say about Musk owning Twitter. You'll, so, you'll, you will, <laughs> speaking hard, you will see soon Dogecoin to the moon. Uh, they're all... Everyone, all the Dogecoin fans are all happy, giddy that if this goes through Dogecoin, like I said, maybe the standard currency for Twitter. Uh, Musk loves crypto. You can buy stuff through uh, Tesla's, through crypto, I think, yet. So it's looking good. So why do I bring all this up? Well, let's go over here. Let's go over to Zergi Pool. So why don't you start getting paid out? If you're mining CPUs right now and you're getting, uh, what, 13 cents, what is it trading at? 14 cents Dogecoin. You go to Zerg Pool, you can mine one of the profitable coins, which you go down to the pool status, and you have a CPU. Look, you're getting the profits here of 0.6, estimated on a Minotaur X, which is Avian. Or you got Veris Hash, which is a hot one right now. You can mine that coin. But here's the beauty of Zerg Pool. You can get paid out in Dogecoin. Uh, all you do in your um, SRB miner, I'm using SRB miner to do my CPU mining. You basically, in the uh, password line, you can put right here I have, here is the coin I want to get paid out of, which, paid out as, which is C equals, I want to get paid out in Pulsar coin, but the MC, which is the mine coin, I want to mine Varus coin. That is the beauty of Zerg pool. You pick the most profitable coin, you get paid out, right? So what I did the other day, I did before the Twitter thing became more prevalent in the news today, <clears throat> I was mining uh, Varus coin, and I did have C equals D O G E D O G E for Dogecoin, and I was collecting Doge. I figured, oh, why not? That's interesting. I only got two Doge because I wanted to see if it would work, and uh, yeah, it works. So there you go. There is an option to go ahead. So if you want to go, you can go to Zerg Pool. You can read more about it. Do your own research, not financial advice. Any of this. This is all just entertainment. If you listen to any fool on YouTube. Buyer beware. I'm telling you, I don't do it. It's good for entertainment only. Some people may have some interesting bits of information, but use your own critical thinking skills to say, eh, that's not right for me. Yesterday, I listened to a whole bunch of entrepreneurs talk about ways to go out and get business and that. Sure, it sounds great and easy, but to actually go do it, you're, you're fighting a million other people. If Doge is on the horizon and maybe mooning, taken off, either go out and buy stuff through KuCoin or something like that, or wherever you can buy Doge, stock up on some Dogies. And uh, or if you want to, just turn your miner, your rigs are working right now. You can, uh, instead of chasing the coin like Yada coin, Varus coin, Raptorium, you can just go out and say, hey, Varus coin se seems to be a profitable coin right now. Let me get paid out in Doge. And here you go to Zerg pool. You can pick the payout method. You want Bitcoin. You want some Litecoin. You want some Bitcoin hash, whatever that BC, I forget what that is. Uh, Raven coin. 
Ethereum USDT uh, stablecoin. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, you just got to specify, like I showed you right here, your payout currency, and you can say Doge. Simple as that. Just a thought. I don't know. Is it profitable? Is it worth putting the electricity towards? Or do you just want to stack coins in the other one? Because right now I am kind of stacking some other coins just so I can stake them and then let them grow. Like planting little seeds, little baby crypto seeds, and uh, put them out in the wallet. Let them stake, you know, in the Atomic wallet, in the um, Pulsar coin wallet, in the uh, Raptorium I know Z, all that stuff. Just kind of get those planted because we may be in this law, crypto law for a year or so. You know, it seems to be patterns of three to four years. Uh, yeah, people are talking about Twitter. And with that, there's collateral, which is Dogecoin. You got to go with this guy likes. Yeah, the guy's doing a lot of stuff. Now he's uh, looking at solar and maybe more Bitcoin mining with the solar stuff, I think. I read that about him and maybe Dorsey doing something. Jack Dorsey, former former CEO, and I think he was on the board of Twitter. He owns 2% of Twitter. So I don't know if he's part of this buyout as well. But anyway, the focus is on how to put some more money in your pocket to make you financially free. Uh, don't go buy Lambos and crap. You see people saying if you hit it big, no. You put that money away and you have financial freedom to go do what you want. Does this make sense? Put your CPU miners on a profitable coin, an algorithm, and get paid out in Doge. I think after I get my certain stack in Pulsar coin, I may just start doing that. I should do it now if the thing takes off. What do you guys think? I'm just throwing it out there. Maybe something to put into your portfolio, whether you mine it or buy it outright. Again, not financial advice, just talking it out loud trying to see what others are doing, whether it makes sense. Dogecoin to the moon? I don't know. All right, guys, go forward to great things. Let me know about Doge. Are you going to buy Doge? Are you going to mine Doge? Curious. I mean, you can go do the Atacoin. You can go do the Raptorium again. I don't know. The Doge is in the news. It may go up. It may go down. It may go sideways. It may go backwards. You don't know. <laughs> you just don't know. But it's all fun. All right, I'm out, guys. Go forth and do the greatest things you can do. Bye.